Hi everyone, I'm Aaron Runt. Today what we're going to do is I'm going to show you how to import a new template or a new machine into your file. So right here we have a, a, a base screen and you can see that I have a lathe here but what I want to do is I want to import a new machine. So if it's not in my template, I'm going to go to import. So I'm going to go to import and what happens is it's going to ask me to select a file. So when I hit the select the file, it's going to come into here and I want to do a mill. So right here where it says mill.set, that's the file that I want to do. It's a set file. So I'm going to click it and I'll hit open. Now, right when you see this right here, it's going to tell you that you want to import it and include it in the template and you hit create. Well, I have just recently created one, so it's already in the template file. So as soon as you hit create, it'll take a few minutes, but it will start loading it in. You will see the progress bar. So once it's in there, this screen will go back to blank and it'll come back to here. But even though you just imported it, it's not going to be right here. So from right here, I'm going to add a machine. Okay, I'm gonna create it from the template. So when I get to here, I'll hit my drop down arrow and you'll see down here at the bottom, after you've imported it, it will be available. So I'll click it and I will hit create. And like I said, if you wanna put a customized image right there, you can go ahead and do that. But we're just gonna click create. And sometimes it will take just a second, I think because I had already added it, it happened a lot faster. But now, every time I close this software and open it back up, these two machines will be there. So from here, you're able to start watching the other videos on how to start the machines and utilize them.